What's up, Falcons Nation? It's your boy, Jew, coming at you with another Atlanta Falcons video. As always, Falcons Nation, rise up. In today's video, I'd like to give you guys some Atlanta Falcons news. But if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you know when I've done Atlanta Falcons content or NFL content. If you'd like to follow your boy on Twitter and Instagram, you can follow me at Jew Talk Sports. If you'd like to donate to my channel, you can donate to my cash out, which is the dollar sign Jew Talk Sports. And if you'd like to be a part of my Jew Talk Sports membership, you can hit that join tab here on the channel as well. Uh, but with that being said, let's jump right into the video. So today in Atlanta Falcons news, uh, the Atlanta Falcons have placed defensive uh, lineman Rook Aurora uh, on IR. Uh, he did suffer an ankle injury in last Sunday's matchup against the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Uh, so it looks like Rook could be out uh, for the next uh, couple weeks, uh, possibly miss the next four games with him being on IR. So this does give other players an opportunity to step up. Uh, we possibly could see Brandon Dorless, our other rookie that we drafted out of Oregon, uh, possibly get a chance to get some playing time. Um, and I expect them to start shuffling the deck and allow some of these other guys to step up and possibly get more snaps. Guys like Zach Harrison, guys like Damone Harris could possibly get uh, more snaps. Uh, guys like Eddie Goldman, who hasn't gotten a ton of snaps, possibly could start seeing more playing time uh, due to the injury to Rook Aurora. Uh, but I like what I've seen out of Rook uh, do the first couple games that he's played in. Uh, he has made an impact uh, both on stopping the run and also uh, getting quarterback pressure. So I wish Rook nothing but the best as far as a speedy recovery. And then today, also in Atlanta Falcons news, the Falcons have um signed Rashawn Evans uh middle linebacker they did pull him up to the 53 man active roster they signed him today due to Root being taken off of the active roster um and this is good news for our Falcons as well because Rashawn Evans is one of those guys uh, that can possibly play that middle linebacker position until we get uh Troy Anderson completely healthy uh, Rashawn Evans is a guy that played for our Falcons about two seasons ago and had over 100 tackles. Uh, he's a veteran guy that's been around the league, played with the Tennessee Titans, and he's a downhill thumper uh, type of linebacker, similar to um, Caden Ellis, similar to uh, Nate Lambin that we currently have on this roster. So with us moving Rashawn Evans to this active roster, we possibly can use Caden Ellis a little bit more on the edge as far as rushing the passer, being that we've been having struggles with rushing the passer, uh, hopefully adding Rashawn Evans to this active roster possibly gives him a chance to make his debut this season with our Atlanta Falcons uh, with him being moved up from the practice squad. But he is one of those guys that's a trustworthy guy to put at the middle of the field as far as being able to make plays at coming downhill and stopping the run. Uh, Rashawn Evans is really good at being that thumper coming downhill. So I definitely think uh, adding him to the active roster could help our linebacking core because we are nicked up. Guys like J.D. Bertrand um, has been dealing with an injury. Uh, Troy Anderson has been out the last couple weeks uh, with his uh, with his injury. So we've been kind of shorthanded out there at that inside linebacker position with just Nate Lambin and Caden Ellis. So hopefully adding Rashawn Evans to this lineup uh, gives us a little bit more flexibility as far as guys being able to rush the passer uh, in Caden Ellis. But with that being said, uh, you guys give me your thoughts on Rashawn Evans being added to the active 53-man roster. You guys give me your thoughts on Ruka Roro going down um, and being placed on IR. With that being said, I'll have a lot more content coming for you guys. But as always, Falcons Nation, rise up, be blessed, peace.